This week, Israel is uh, hosting the uh, COMEDS, which is the summit of the committees of the Surgeon Generals of all NATO countries, the Mediterranean Dialogue countries, and the Partners for Peace. This uh, conference is a platform for collaboration, knowledge sharing, talking about mutual experience in the field of humanitarian missions, and also on military civil cooperation to non-conventional threats. We'll today demonstrate Israel's capability in uh, dealing with the threat of nuclear, biological, and chemical threat in the Soroka Medical Hospital, gathering together the civilian capabilities, the hospital capabilities, and military unit capabilities. NATO countries are asked to see the way we train, the way we prepare for these threats. So I hope uh, we'll find another uh, platform to share knowledge and to learn from each other how to deal with the next threats. Disaster preparedness and contingency planning for mass casualty events are a major part of our hospital's day-to-day -day working. Regretfully, we have uh, quite a bit of experience with real-life conventional warfare situations. The drill today will prepare us for a scenario we are fortunate not to have experienced so far of chemical warfare. We are honored to have been selected uh, by the Israeli Defense Forces uh, to demonstrate our capabilities in this uh, unique area. I was very much impressed uh, by uh, what uh, was shown here uh, in uh, Beersheba, the way uh, you are prepared. I think the fact that we have this uh, NATO conference uh, in the Mediterranean Dialogue organized uh, with Israel shows uh, the fact that we have a very close cooperation and that we are able uh, to work together as doctors, as partners, uh, because uh, we are in the field of medicine and we want to do the best of our patients wherever uh, uh, we need to be there for them. And that's the way we cooperate. We cooperate for the sake of the soldiers. Fine, thanks.